Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new video, my name is Matt. Today's video we're going over the controls and the user interface on Farming Simulator 20. So you can see on the screen now, there is a picture of the Farming Simulator 20 gameplay and this is from the Google Play website and it's a really nice image actually, it shows everything. So that's awesome. And you can see there, I'm just going to get straight on with it. So at the top you can see the shop, so that basket, you click on that when you want to go to the shop and like buy vehicles and that and you can buy tools and everything like that in the shop so that's really awesome next that you have the money and I'm assuming you can change the money so from dollars to euros to like pounds or whatever to whatever currency you want so that that would be awesome and so they've got 593,000 so a lot so they probably start on some sort of new farmer setting so that's cool then we have fuel on the um, next to the money which is a really awesome feature. If you actually saw the gameplay videos, you will know that there is a fuel station around and like a um, a gas station, if you want to call it that. And like, it's like a mechanic station. It's really good. And you can see it's really good detail, very realistic. So that's awesome. Then next to the like gas icon, you can see the map. So the map, you can click on that, see the location, see like where everything is, see where you are, see where your helps are everything anything you need to know about the like the map you click on that button and it will be really awesome just like fs19 so that's awesome moving on to the thing next to it that is the settings so that will include stuff like um i don't know it'll have lots of settings in there but like currency like i said it'll be in there'll be some settings like sensitivity and there'll probably some sort of brick to reverse setting or something like that many settings like fs18 and 19 There'll probably be like some sort of weather setting, I hope, in there. So that'll be awesome. And then moving on to the main bits. In the bottom left, you can see the steering. I assume you'll be able to change this to tilt as well. Like FS18, so you can tilt your phone or your tablet. And you can steer with that. Or you can use like the slidey thing in the bottom left. So either one you can use. And they are both really good. So that's awesome. And then that's a really good steering method actually is the slidey thing. It's in plenty of mobile games. And the next is the swap vehicles. So this is, um, yeah, again, a great feature. So you can easily, like, swap two vehicles. So if you was on PC, it would be the tab button on the keyboard. So that's an awesome feature. So you can swap vehicles easily. So if you want to swap from your combine into your truck to go for a, like, empty combine, then you can do with one button. Right. And then next we have, I think that is the connector button so you connect a vehicle and connect stuff like that so if you want to connect a trailer to the tractor that the thing is driving now um, if you want to connect like a trailer or something to the tractor then you'd press that button and it would connect it which is awesome and a very cool feature and then next to it is where it, it shows if it's connected or not so you will know if something's connected because that will be orange rather than white and then next to it what is like the person thing so like the person so you'll be able to see your stats and like everything like that and what's going on in your farm and just like a quick overview and stuff like that. Then moving on to the thing in the furthest right, you can see that's a speedometer. So you can actually move that up and down and you go faster and slower. And if you have brake to reverse on, if that is a setting, you can actually like reverse by putting it right down to the bottom. And I assume it will be because it's got a bit further. You can see the where the white line stops. It's got a bit underneath that which you can actually pull all the way down. And it will reverse, I'm assuming. Um, but that'd be awesome if it did. And then you can see, so you drag that up, go faster, and you have your speed in the top. So you know how fast you're going. And yeah, that's it. Pretty self-explanatory in FS18 as well. So yeah, that's that. And in the um, left, you can actually see the map. So that is sort of like another map sort of thing. But it will be like a main menu, so you can see your stats, your vehicles, and you see everything like that. Your contract, if that's going to be in the game. And everything like that so you can see your trailer information as well so that's awesome and that's really all the ui and like the controls and that will be in farms and loads 20 and you can look at the landscape as well it looks absolutely amazing you see the ponds like the pond like the lake in the background looks really good and the obviously the soil it looks really good as well and yeah that's all i want to say to today's video if you did enjoy make sure you do hit the like button helps me out a lot and if you like enjoy these videos, make sure you subscribe and turn notifications on. 
and comment down below what your favorite part about this screenshot is because I'm kind of curious. So yeah, hope everyone has a lovely day. See you for the next time.